everyone this is patrice with the positivity corner and i am back with another video i am going to do my usual one-offs and when i say one-offs these are just in no particular order just some of my favorite tunes and we're gonna concentrate I think on the 70s, I think the last time I did a bunch of one-offs, there was probably dance classics. And I also did, of course, the 60s, which I'm going to get back to definitely in 2021 because there are so many really good songs that came out of that decade as well. But right now we're talking 1970s. This gentleman right here, you may not recognize if you live outside of the DMV, DC, Maryland, and Virginia. But I'm telling you right now, this dude, he's a legend, absolute legend. His name is Chuck Brown. He had a group called Chuck Brown and the Soul Searchers. And he is considered the godfather of go-go music. If you're asking yourself, what the hell is go-go music? Go-go music is a sub-genre of funk music that originated in what we call the DMV, the Washington, D.C. region. And it's still played today. And it's funky as hell. Ooh, I, I had never heard of go-go music before this gentleman. I had no idea what it was. And when I heard Chuck Brown and the Soul Searchers back in the 1970s. Wow, I was hooked. And you know, from watching this channel, I already love the funk. Chuck Brown had a record that was certified gold in the mid 70s, and it is considered an absolute classic of that genre of go-go music it's a winner i'm telling you it's so damn funky and his band the soul searches they were fierce 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 that's all you could say consummate musicians and of course chuck was the leader and he was a guitar player a singer and a band leader and he's the godfather of go-go that's what he's called he's no longer with us may he rest in peace but uh this song was so popular in um funk war that you will still hear it on occasion. Every once in a blue moon, someone will whip this classic out. And rightly so. Because it, like I said, it's a winner. <laughs> it is definitely a winner. This is the title track of the album. And it was released in 1979. Chuck Brown and the Soul Searchers with a classic. And it's called Bustin' Loose. <laughs> Y'all. 
You got to give a lot just to get what you need sometimes, y'all.
stop doing that. Chuck Brown and the Soul Searchers, Bustin' Loose. Ooh, we, I love it. And you know I'm a sucker for the saxophone. When that saxophone comes in at the end, hey, Leroy, play some of that horn right here. Ooh, child. Don't get no better than that. This song is so popular in the DMV that the Washington Capitals, who is the hockey team in Washington, D.C. I don't know if they still do it, but they used to play bust and loose during every single home game. <laughs> People love Chuck Brown in the DMV. He's got a street named after him, a park named after him. He is very, very fondly remembered. A lot of it is because he performed so much in D.C. and in the area of the DMV. Countless live shows over his career. Thank you, Chuck Brown, for that classic. Ooh-wee. Mm, like I said, that's a winner right there. Mm, love it. As always, this is Patrice with the Positivity Corner. Please like, click, share, subscribe, push that button, y'all, for further content. And I will be back with some more favorites. <laughs> 